We learned about you, Mum, from Larry Butler. Larry didn't have to be much of a spokesperson. He was showing us what was happening. And it was, it was very difficult not to say, okay, Larry, how can we help you? And that, that's how it started. I think it really was when Bruce and I went through you, Mom, for the very first time. I think we, we got it. It felt so good to us. And we, our foundation has been involved for a long time with a lot of homeless projects. So this one really inspired us um, because it was the first one that we really could see hands on children being nurtured by adults and professional people. We were very moved. So we started granting right away. They both have this deep abiding sense of responsibility. I work off a kind of a simple little program. I, I, my, my priorities are in this order family, employees, and community. And that's about how I look at everything. To me, they have been an amazing example of how to treat one another and how to treat the greater community. We have started other organizations around the valley, and what has happened is we've been able to coordinate those things with you, Mom, such as our Live and Learn project. The Live and Learn grant for me changed my life because it gave me a brand new career. It gives them the opportunity to be trained so that they can look at themselves with the, uh, with the idea that there's an opportunity here that they can take. I was lucky enough to be blessed with this grant through extremely hard work. And I was so grateful and so, um, you know, it was just so amazing. And the individual that I work with at Live and Learn, Denise Schubert, um, kept saying to me, no, 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 this is all you. You earned this. This is not something that we give willy-nilly. It was very important. And it, you know, I think that's important for me to know because then um, it allows me to own that success and build up that self-esteem that was so very important. I have seen the graduation of these ladies and it moves you to a different place. It has nothing to do with the granting that we've done. It has to do with that moment in our time when we actually look at how we've changed another person's life. It takes away all the worry, where I don't have to worry about my basic. I can just worry about my schooling. I can worry about what I, I'm needing to do. And I was able to concentrate on my healing um, the, the entire process. And then it allowed me to share uh, my success with others. So it wasn't like I'm still a victim, I'm still um, just accepting aid, I'm allowed to give back, I'm allowed to be a part of the process, which is huge. They understood it was my journey, but that I wasn't walking it alone. Bruce and Diane are amazing role models. They chose to live in Arizona, they are not from here. Um, so I think they made a very conscious decision to support and make Arizona, the Phoenix area, a better place. And I think they've been, from where I sit, wildly um, successful. To be honored is not important. What is important is the work that you mom is doing. And we can support them to do some of this work for us. And, and that gives us great joy. But we don't do the work. They do the work. We do the easiest part, and that's what we would encourage other people to do with us. Do the easy part if you can, and if you can't, jump in and do the harder part.